everybody, welcome back to a brand new Let's Stream. This is Pokemon Heart Gold, except there's a twist, it's a randomizer. Now, what is a randomizer? A randomizer is something that you can download off the internet and the interwebs and apply it to, I think, up to Gen 5 games. I think it's, uh, I think, up to black and white. And what it does is you can play play with a lot of different settings. You can randomize, it's pretty much what it says, you can randomize stuff. So, what I ended up doing is this. Um, three starting Pokemon are randomized, so we'll no longer start with Chikorita, Bulbasaur, or not Bulbasaur, that's the wrong generation. Chikorita, <laughs> Cyndaquil, and Totodial. Um, wild encounters are randomized by area. So, I can route one, whatever route we started, we won't encounter a Pidgey. And instead of a Pidgey, we could encounter a Dragonite. Who knows what we're going to encounter. Um, trainer name, trainer, um, trainers are randomized. What, what, I, what I mean by that is classes. And their names and also their teams so they won't have the same teams as you would normally as they would normally items that you could find in the field are randomized so you could find master balls and for all you know um, Pokemon move sets are randomized so a Pikachu could learn leaf blade or Cyndaquil can learn Water Gun. So, it's going to be interesting. TMs are also randomized. So, I think the first team that you get in the first, from the first team was Roost. That will no longer be Roost. That will be something completely different. Gym Trainers are also randomized too, so they won't have their, their ordinary team setups. Uh, it's going to be fun. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna see how this plays out. Because unlike a normal playthrough, I won't know what I would normally end up having as a final team. Because for the randomizing stuff, because anything from gym one to five can be can appear. So this is gonna be interesting. I don't have any information. Also, that it'll brought in a couple more cool little settings. Looks like the sun is descending in the sky. So, this would be what it is called Twilight, wouldn't it? Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world, world, world the wonderful world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Oak. But everyone calls me the Perf Pokemon Professor. Before we go any further, I'd like to tell you a few things you should know about the world this world. This world is broadly inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. It's a Meryl! We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together, and other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop close bonds with them. Now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Uh, do I have to? Are you a boy or a girl? Won't you please tell me? I don't know. I think I'm this, but I could be this. I'm going with this. I could be wrong. So you're a girl, yes? Uh, sure, why not? Alright. Button layouts. Do I not have to select? There we go. Your name is Ghost, right? Uh, yes. Ghost, are you ready? Your very own tale of grand adventure is about to unfold. Fun experiences, difficult experiences, there's so much to play for you. Dreams, adventure! Let's go to the wonderful world of Pokemon. 
See you later. And I get shrunk down to mini sized. Alright. Before I go any further. Uh, oh, I, gotta get, I guess I gotta get my stuff. Hi, ghost. You finally awake. Your friend Ethan was just here. He was playing hide and seek with his Meryl. Oh, I almost forgot. Our acquaintance, Professor Anne, was looking for you. He said he had a favor to ask of you. You know where the lab is, right? It's right next door to us. By the way, do you have anything you need to go need to go out? Here, use this bag to carry things. Oh, thanks. This is your trading card. Here is your here you can save your record of your progress. These are also very helpful. Just try touching the buttons, and you'll know what to do in no time. Oh, thanks. Thanks for that. Okay. Alright. I just realized. Uh, it's a little cut off. Hold on. One second. Let me fix this. Oops, that's not what I want. There we go. Fixed. Alright. I forgot, I don't... My D-pad controls are kind of funky. So I have to remember to use the thumbstick. We're gonna... We're gonna go with the wood type. Brick type. Alright, Ethan, what you got? I love Pokemon, huh? Okay. Thanks. That's a, that's a great email. Huh. I didn't encounter... I did test this out a little bit before doing this. I did encounter some funky little glitches, but nothing too bad. Um, hopefully. Hopefully not. I didn't get too far into the testing. I only got to my first set of Pokemon and a couple fights outside. That was it. Now, when I first tested this out, I had a very lousy team. <laughs> I think I had like a snow run, uh, a Metapod, and a um, uh, what was it? it was a oh, it was a Charmander, which wasn't bad at all, but, you know, still not an ideal setup. was kind of hoping for something more. But, oh well. That's what that's a randomizer for you. I re-randomized it, so I'll have something completely different. Hi, Ghost. I've been waiting for you. Do you know anything about my research? Uh, sure. As you know, Pokemon are carried in Pokeballs these days, but before the Pokeballs invented, people used to walk with Pokemon, just like your friend Ethan does. Is that really much of a technological advancement? I mean... <laughs> Pokeballs are great because you can carry many Pokemon, but walking with Pokemon must have some advantages. It could have something to do with how Pokemon grow or evolve, so I'm going to give you a Pokemon. Can you walk beside this Pokemon outside this Pokeball? to see if this brings any special things or bonds between people, Pokemon people. The device over there has some Pokemon you can choose from. Oh, hey, I got an, I got an email. Uh-huh, uh-huh, okay. Hey, listen, I have this acquaintance that people, good people call Mr. Pokemon. I'm talking too fast. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got his e an email from him saying that this time it's real. Probably another Pokemon egg, but we're still so busy with our Pokemon research. Wait, I know. You can do my dirty work for me. You can go in our place, right? Can we count on you? You can choose one of the Pokemon over there. Oh, thanks. That's... You can do our dirty work and you can have this as compensation. That's great. Alright. Who are the three Pokemon that, we, that we're going to be stuck with this playthrough? 
Alright, touch the Pokeball and see what Pokemon's inside. We've got... An Eevee! Woo! It's like this game knows me. Uh, sp fuck Spoink. Shup it. Eh. You know what? I don't like Spoink. Shup it's garbage. And this game, like, it's like this game knows me, so I'm going with Eevee. Yes! Give Poke name nickname to the Eevee? Uh, I don't really do nicknames. Um, no. No nicknames. I don't do nicknames. How do you walk? What, how do you like walking around with Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You can take it all the way to Mr. Pokemon's house. Pokemon gets hurt, you should heal it with this medicine. With this, this medicine. That's a pretty advanced sentiment. That's a pretty advanced medicine you got there. It's so easy to use. Just check the PC on my desk. Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Let's go north a little past Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you, ghost. Alright. So let's see what kind of moves we got, because. Moves are randomized, and also the Pokemon abilities are randomized too. So let's see what we got. We've got. Oh, we got Dragon Breath, Leech Seed, and Rat. Those are two are moves, but the Dragon Breath isn't bad at all. Huh. That's actually pretty good. Huh. Not so much a leech seed or rat, but hey, we got Dragon Breath. We got Scrappy. And it was moves to hit ghost Pokemon, so hey. I mean, if I had any normal type moves, I mean that could be that could be good, right? I'm not complaining. That's actually pretty good. I'm not complaining about that start. I swear, when I started out, when I chose, I chose Charmander last time, and he had the worst move set ever. He didn't even have a fire move. He had like, um, um, he had um, what did he have? I can't remember what he had. Um, he had pound. No, 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 not pound. Um, what do you have? He had some crap move set. That's all I'm, I can't remember. It's been a couple days since I tested this out. But hey, I'm not complaining about that dragon breath. Ghost, don't you have these to help you with your task? No thanks. Pokemon are weak in the beginning. Don't hesitate to use a potion if you think yours is in danger. Oh joy! Ghost. So you picked an Eevee. That's a cute Pokemon you have. I know. When you walk with it, it'll be become more friendly. I wonder if I'll be able to get an Espeon. Well, evolutions are not randomized, so evolutions are still yeah, you know as is. You can randomize the evolution, so a Pikachu could evolve into a Bulbasaur for all I know. But I didn't do that. Turn around and talk with sometimes too. Oh, what's right? I want to go show it to your mom. See ya. I know you're just jealous of my Eevee. Who needs your Meryl? He's sniffing at me. I forgot these games don't have the running shoes until like a little bit later on. <laughs> I'm pressing B trying to run. There's no running. Oh, Ghost, that's a cute Pokemon you have. Professor Al must have given it to you? Oh, Professor Al has a task for you, you say? What kind of task? I'm just doing his dirty work. He's sending uh, a 13 year old, a 12 year old boy or girl out in the wilderness on their own to do God knows what they're gonna do. I see that sounds a little difficult, but when someone makes that kind of a request for you, it must be important. No, they're just lazy. And they just want children to do their work for them. Oh, that's right, I completely forgot. 
Your Poke Gear came back from the repair shop. Here you go. Oh joy, I got a phone! The, poke, po the Pokemon Gear, or Poke Gear, as often it's called, is what every trainer should have. Guess what? You can use the Poke Gear to make a phone call too. Do you know how? Remember how? Uh, I can figure it out. Just power on the Poke Gear and touch the bo telephone button, okay? The names of the people you call are automatically registered. Just select one to give him or her a call. Wow, I can't believe it's so easy to make a phone call. I mean. Alright. I'm just not gonna. It sucks not having the running shoes. <laughs> wait a minute. Wait one second. I'm doing your dirty work for you. What are you doing? You keep me from doing your shit. I almost completely forgot about this. Here, I'll give you my number. Oh, good. I got his, I got his phone number. So he can call and complain to me every time he breaks his back. I'll call you when the funny thing comes up. Please don't. I don't want to be hammered by phone calls. Alright. Let's see what kind of Pokemon we can encounter in here. Because we also have a chance to encounter legendaries too, so that'll be fun. So we can encounter like level 5 Mewtwo. Oh. We got a Dragonite! <laughs> well, shit. I don't have any Pokeballs either. I'll have to come back with this. Damn it. Alright, what moves he got? He's got Leaf Storm! Okay. Uh, if I don't run, I'm gonna die. Maybe I'll have a different move. Oh, my controls are so weird. Oh shit! <laughs> We're almost dead already. All right. So he's got Leaf Storm and Wing Attack. I almost died right right away. The first fight in the game. Okay, that was bad right up immediately. All right, so I'm definitely coming back with that Dragonite. I don't think I want to fight that thing again, though. Running shoes. I need the running shoes so badly. I believe there's an iron rat. Ha! So let's see what this side of it. I think this was a chest of berry. That's great. It's great. I think that used to be like a poster or something. You gotta come to the hound door. It's got water pulse. Oh, good. Wonderful. No one needs your confusion. Ah, you're paralyzed, bitch. And he still gets me off my kids off.
to see what's up here, but I can come back when I have both balls. What you gotta say, dude? I wanna take a break so I can save my progress. Okay, good, good on you. I wonder if the berries are randomized, too. We got a Persian. That's great. So far, the only noteworthy Pokemon I've seen so far is Dragonite. Ah! <laughs> it's got Dig! Oh no. Well. Haha, <laughs> you can't move! Nice try. Away from up. Let's see if the berries are randomized. Or the apricorns, not the berries. That's not the put it oh, figures. Money for Pokemon that only appear at night. I build oh yeah, that's right. I wonder if that's different for me. I guess I'll have to wait till nighttime to roll to roll around. I didn't think about that. I'd assume so. Pokemon are randomized by area rather than globally, so rather than having like a ton of Pokemon, a big pool of possible Pokemon to appear, it's restricted just area by area. So it might this might be all the Pokemon that we can find? Come on, really? Finish this thing off. That's okay. Maybe next time. Alright, come on. Nope. Still nothing, huh? It's got a weather ball. That dealt nothing. Alright, Eevee. I'm not running away, I'm so close to leveling up. Again, Dragonite seems like the only noteworthy Pokemon here. Come on, Eevee. There we go. Also, the moves they can learn are randomized too, so Eevee can learn Thunderbolt for all I know. Trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everyone has a rookie at some point. If you like, I can teach you a few things. Okay, then follow me. Sir, you're too fast. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot you weren't wearing the running shoes. I'll try to go as slow as possible, so try keeping up. He's still pretty fast. The thing is, why do you need a pair of shoes to run? I never understood that. This is the Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon in no time at all. We've been relying on them a lot, so we better learn about them. This is the Pokemon Mart. They sell Pokeballs for catching wild Pokemon. Now they're useful items. 
Just right not not right now. Route 30 is that is out this way. The trainers will be bad on their Pokemon there. If you go a little further, you will see Mr. Pokemon's house. Sir, your, sh your shoes are getting wet. This is the sea, as you can see. Some Pokemon are found in the water. Just not now, because everything's randomized. A Goldeen could be in a forest for all. Here! It's my house! For your efforts keeping up with me, I'll give you, give you my running shoes. They're still warm! I have my shoes. Got you, didn't I? Don't worry, these are brand new. Thanks! I got a pair of shoes from an old man. Also holds block okay. I can run! Alright. What the hell do you want now, old man? I'm on a business trip right here. Uh, uh, I made it. I forgot one thing. This is also another token for me. Take it. It's the guy, gent, loaded the map card on bo uh, my poker gear. Oh, good. Stuck the poker gear on the touchscreen and select the town map icon. You'll see the map on the region you're currently in. The poker gear becomes more useful as you add cards. I wish you luck on your journey. Thanks. Alright, what kind of trouble can I get in here? Hey, look, a rare candy! Cool. Yeah. Let's throw that on, because why not? I gotta fix these controls. Oh, look, medical wall. Yippee! in here. Arm Armaldo? That's not bad. I probably should go to should probably go rest up. It's got vice grip. Oh my god! Oh shit! That almost killed me. Okay. I definitely go to the Pokemon now. Alright. Evacuate! Evacuate! Heal my Pokemon. My Eevee's hurt. Alright. Let's reset ourselves. Alright, so Normaldo. What else is in here? Another Armaldo. That attack is pretty dangerous, so I gotta be careful. It's got Thunder Wave. Back to the Polka Center. Yeah, see, this is the glitch. One of the glitches. This character model thing. It's weird. It resets if I go in and out of buildings. Alright. I was just here. I'm not sure what causes that glitch. I don't know if it's just an emulator problem. No, 
I just want to go further. Ooh, I got an Elkid. I can get a Lucky Buzz. Also, I'll cha my, I change it so Pokemon that requires things like evolution or trading, like to get Alakazam. Oh, that's a the best point. That's my point. Like uh, to get Alakazam, I change that. It's got this freaking sandstorm. What? It's got eruption. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, that did shit all. Wow, that did nothing. That did one damage. What shit! How does a rupture do one damage? All right. Hey, you were hurt in running shoes. They make you feel like you're flying there, don't they? But beware, while Pokemon and trainers, when you run, the noise will attract them. Right. You! You mean you come to my house up from Mr. Pokemon's house, but you did you did mean to visit my house, right? Uh, sure, why not? I'll, I'll... Do you have any po apricorns? Apricorn trees bear fruit once a day. I have one of these trees too. You can make up you can make pokeballs and other things. They're quite useful. I have a feeling this is meant to be, so I'm happy I'm so happy I'll give you this. Oh cool. Gus, put the apricorn box in the key items. Alright, with that apricorn box, you can carry so many apricorns, it will be you. You don't know what to do with them. You'll be a decent apricorn collector. Will I? I don't even know if I will get apricorns out of these things. Let's find out. Green apricorn. Okay, so I do get apricorn. I still get apricorns out of this. So these aren't randomized. One second. Okay. I keep forgetting I need to run. Hello, kid! Don't need to see your move set. He's got a leaf storm. Brave birds. This guy's got some pretty decent moves so far. I should have bought some potions before going further. A th hey, hello, a Thunderstone! Well, if I uh, catch an Elekid, I might be able to evolve it. I don't know if an Elekid needs a Thunderstone to evolve. I'll be honest with you. I don't- you, I have never once had an Elekid or an Electabuzz in any of my Pokemon parties. So I know nothing about him. What are you doing? He's blinked staring in this direction. You wanna call its name? Sure. Pokemon seems so happy. A Pokemon can use its move as long as it still has BP. PB. A move that has no PP remaining that that 
Pokemon Connect, obviously. They're having a fight. I have a showdown. I keep forgetting to run. Go, Rotata! Tackle! What? This is a big battle. Leave me alone. Oh, fine. I just wanted to see what, how your fight was going. Burn! Do, people, do, do things burn with Dragon's Breath? Probably not. Yoink. Mine. Got a pink apricorn. You must be ghosts. It was I who sent the email to Professor Elm earlier. Alright, what do you got for me? Just pulled some down your file cabinet. This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. Oh good, it's an egg like he thought he was like he like he was like he thought so. He had too much eggs, sir. It's time to have a di it's time to do something differently. A friend of mine from Equity gave it to me. I bet you can't find this kind of egg in Johto. I mean, they're not that rare. Just throw two opposite gender Pokemon in the Poke Center or throw a Ditto in there. And hey, you got Pokemon eggs galore! I thought Professor M might be able to tell what this is. He's the best po best when it comes to research of Pokemon evolution. That's a quote from the Professor Oak. Oh, well, well, why not? You're returned to Professor Elm. Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. Uh, sir? I'm, I'm surrounded by old men. And with that, I'm Professor Rogue, a recent Pokemon researcher. I've left Kanto because I'm shirking off my duties here over here in Johto. So you're a ghost. I was just visiting my friend with his Pokemon. I heard you were running over an air of Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon. I don't know if you count Eevee as rare, but I see. You must be helping Professor Elm's research. I think I understand why Professor Elm gave you that Pokemon. You will treat your Pokemon with love and care, it seems. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? Say, this is the latest version of the Pokedex. It automatically records data on the po on Pokemon you've seen, caught, seen or caught. It's a high-tech high encyclopedia. I'd like you to have it. Do you just carry this stuff in your pockets like all day long waiting for some sequel train to roll along? I'm being forced to do old men's jobs. <laughs> this is not good. Go meet many types and kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I've got to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Ghost, I have a feeling that this is not the last we'll meet. Let's exchange numbers just to be on the same side. Goddamn, fucking old man. Nothing but old men's phone numbers are in my phone. I guess I want to count Professor Elm as an old man, because he's kind of middle-aged. Well, not middle-aged, he's still pretty young. Hello, ghost? The disaster! Um, um, it's, it's just terrible. What should I do? It- oh no. Please get back here now. Well, thanks. Alright, back we go. Vespa Quinn, again! Great!
Has some dragon's breath. Some of the little special effects don't work. Oops. Two steps. Elekid. Might want to come back to this. Elekid and Dragonite. With these, at least with this game, I know, good, I know a couple of good spots to kind of like end videos, so I'm not like overly long like the Trails in the Sky was. So, on that note, I'm gonna save it here. I'm gonna tweak my controls, get them working the way I want them to work, and we will come back and head off to see what the professor is in a, in a huff about. This game ever saves. There we go. Alright. Hope you guys enjoyed.